the ministry of angels. We hear about angels, we talk about angels, but we don't know much how they function, why they are there. Are they not all ministering spirits sent forth to minister for them who shall be heirs of salvation? If they minister for you, that means the places you cannot go, they can go there for you. I can, I can close the message here. The response to your prayers and your petition is through the angelic ministry. The response to your worship is God himself. You cannot be asking God for money. And because you're asking God for money, God will leave his throne to come and give you money. Money is too small to move God from his throne. If you are asking for anything, angels are released in response to minister for you. They have an assignment to minister for you. The Bible made it clear to us that even before you get to a place, there must be an angelic announcement. Before Jesus came, angels announced him. Before John the Baptist came, angels announced him. There's an angelic announcement that must go before you. I don't know if I'm talking to somebody. There is a core angelic ministry that is so real to minister for you. The world was here about you. I don't know if I'm talking to somebody. Even in your businesses, angels are involved. I can be sleeping in my room, but angels are moving on my behalf. I can be sleeping in my room, any arrow thrown against me. He said, I will give my angels charge over you. It's an abomination for somebody that has an angelic defense, angelic protection to be hurt by the enemy. He said, I will give my angels charge over you the ministers of fire are not us but still the angels when sometimes they call your name in certain places your angel will show up in fire your angel will show up like a wind i don't know if i'm talking to somebody we bind every demon that is disturbing our finances we bind them in the name of jesus but you didn't lose the lose the finances to now come so at the end of the day the, 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 the demon causing them is bound but still you are not enjoying the plenty because you didn't loosen your blessings from the spiritual realm when you losing from the spiritual realm angels will bring it that's why miracle money is real that's why miracles are real that's why cgba changes are real that's why your school fees can be paid without you paying anything that's why you can talk to somebody about money and they will release thousands and millions of dollars to you there's an angel that speaks when you speak there's an angel that moves when you move there's an angel that goes before you to announce you before men i don't know if i'm talking to somebody if an angel went before the three wise men that they came and they begin to give all their all their rubies to Jesus I'm telling you something somebody the time has come for us to activate the angelic ministry and say enough is enough you cannot get to America now but your angel can be in America right now you can't get to Canada but God, ah, yeah 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 I'm just I'm just feeling the uh, the fire of my hands right now when the angel appeared to Joshua and said to Joshua, are you for us or are you against us? And, and the angel said, I'm not for anyone. And then he bowed before the angel and worshipped him. But the angel did not say to him, don't bow to me. That means that angel is of a higher cadre. That angel represented somebody. That angel was worthy of worship. And we know that it's only God and only Jesus that we can worship. And somebody is asking me, can Jesus reflect himself as an angel? There stood an angel of God. Whom? Whose I am. That means I belong to this angel and whom I serve. And if there is an angel that he belongs to, that means even us can operate as angels. If we will study the angelic realm, we will know that there is no angel that is higher than us. But here Paul is saying, there is an angel whose I am and whom I serve. I'm not here to psych you. I'm here to tell you what is obtainable in the word of God. I'm here to tell you that there are angels and they are real. There are angels that are in human form. There are angels and they are real. Pandoka ratunde kofrante 
Paul said, though I speak in the tongues of angels and the tongues of men. That is in tongues of angels. It's time to stand on your true height.